In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where your videos are not playing in Google Chrome. So whether you're using YouTube or another website and the video is not playing, this video is going to show you exactly how to solve this issue. Now, the first thing you need to do is just head over to the website of which you're having video issues with and then clicking on this icon next to the URL bar. Click on cookies and site data and then press manage on device site data. From here, you just want to click the trash icon next to all of these cookies like so. Make sure to do the same from this top section as well. And then once you've removed all of these, you can just click on done. Now, if that didn't work, the next thing you need to do is head over to these three vertical dots in the top right hand side, scroll all the way down and select settings from the left hand side, click on system and make sure to turn off use graphics acceleration when available. Make sure this is toggled off like so. Make sure continue running background apps when Google Chrome is closed. Make sure this is also switched off. Then from the left hand side, we're going to come down to about Chrome and make sure you're running the latest version of Google Chrome. Then we're going to come up and click on privacy and security from the left hand side. Scroll down and click on site settings. Scroll down again until you see JavaScript and click on this and make sure sites can use JavaScript. Make sure this is turned on. And then finally, we're going to click back on privacy and security. Click on delete browsing data. Make sure all three of these options are checked and then press delete data. Once you've done that, you can try heading back over to your website to check if that's now fixed your issue. If it's still not working, what you'll need to do is head back over to these three vertical dots, click on extensions and select manage extensions. Then just go through this list and turn off and disable all of the applications you currently have enabled. You can do that just by toggling this button like so, and then you can try heading back over to your website and that should have now solved any issues you were having. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.